Proudly brought to you by Up and Go Liquid Breakfast. Up and Go Banana Flavor. Let's up and go. Up and go. to today's episode of What the Heck is Jack Ward Now? Uh, this is gonna be a really exciting episode. I have made a pretty cool purchase. Um, actually, I made two. So I bought, as you can see, I'll, um, you'll probably see, I'm recording this the night before, but tomorrow, um, Jacob and I are gonna take the tinny out to test this new thing that I bought for the boat. But I bought a new lens, so hopefully when I'm doing the vlogging style sort of thing, it's not gonna just like focus on this little part of my face here. Um, like it used to do this. So hopefully you'll be able to see like a lot more of my face now, um, which is awesome. So I finally upgraded the lens, uh, which is cool. Um, the other exciting purchase, here it is. I'm very excited about this. It's, it was something that was really needed as you would have seen if you'd watched the other videos. The Maxis. Uh, so this is basically like a Mercury, but it's just the Chinese version. Um, it's a 15 horsepower, um, so I'm pretty keen to see how it goes. We're going to go and test it out at Leslie Dam tomorrow, um, but it's I think it's a 2017 or something like that. Um, so it's all mid condition. Um, he, the fellow that I bought it off, um, I think I paid about 800 bucks um, with a tank um, and a line, um, and he's just replaced a few parts on it. Um, and it was highly used, it pumps heaps of water, um, so it seems like it's in really good condition, which is great. It also has this nifty little cable which will charge the battery as well, so that's cool. I don't really need it, but it's good to have, um, possibly for the longer trips and stuff. So, um, a very worthy upgrade, and it means that I can just not worry about having that other motor. I mean, I'm going to take my kids on this tinny, and I'm going to be hopefully doing some longer trips in the future with it. So having a reliable engine is probably important to me. So uh, we'll take it out tomorrow. We're going to give it a quick test run. The, as I said, it's a 15 horsepower. So the other one was a 9.9 .9 and we couldn't really get it running properly. So I'm pretty keen to see how quick this thing is uh, on the water. Um, the reason I'm taking Jacob with me, number one, he's a good lad. Number two, he's got his boat license, so I need to book a course to get my boat license because anything over six horsepower, uh, you need a license to drive. Um, so I'll have to book that in, but other than that, uh, this is just a precursor for tomorrow's video. I've just got to swap the motors, put all the gear in the boat, and we're just going to go and give it a quick run. Um, Sunday, which will probably be a separate video, we're going to go to Morton Bay. Um, for a quick fish, um, probably near Mud Island or something like that. We're going to go and visit Jared and go out in his boat for the day. Jacob's going to come through, which is sweet. And hopefully I'll be able to bring back some fish and maybe like I could do a catch and cook or something like that. Um, so that's the video um, or the start of the video. So I'm pretty keen to see how we go tomorrow. Lots of anticipation. Uh, this is a, a two stroke. Um, so we've got all the fuel mixed up and everything. It's mixed a little bit strong, so it could be a bit smoky, but um, other than that, I'm very excited to see how it goes tomorrow. I'm also taking Flynn, so it'd be good to see his reaction in the boat. He's never actually been in the tinny before. He's only been on bigger ferries and stuff. So I went and I had to buy a $60 life jacket, which is a fair bit of money for a kid's jacket. But anyway, he'll be safe. And um, yes, we will see you out on the water tomorrow. And as I always say, we'll see how it goes. So we've just pulled up here after getting stuffed around by Google Maps once again. And you probably, I don't know if you'll even be able to hear me because it's so windy. But Google Maps sent us to this other side which was like private, privately owned or something. And so we finally come back here to the Washpool Reserve area which I thought it was going to send us to anyway. Um, and it is so windy. This is the worst I've ever seen it. I don't even think I want to put the boat in because it looks like the bloody ocean. So we're deciding what we do, but I don't think we're going to put the boat in. <laughs> Check out the 
mud. Exhausted, just hours on the boat. <laughs> it was good, floated, and we didn't lose the motor. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Well, that was a uh, partly successful trip. Uh, the motor ran really well, but I don't know. Jacob reckons it was the chop that it was really chopping, and so we couldn't get it to go as fast as I thought it would. But um, that's all right because we weren't planning to go really fast anyway today. Um, but as you could see from yeah, those previous shots, the water was pretty shocking and it was really choppy, so maybe next time we'll come out when it's a bit calmer. Um, we're planning on a bit of a boat change. Jacob's convinced me um, that maybe there's a different lifestyle that could be a bit better for what we want to do. Um, if you watch Rocket Kids videos, you might have a bit of a clue on what sort of boat we might be after. Uh, but this tin is done really well like I said to Jacob before the um, I've, I've achieved the two things I wanted to do which was make sure it floated and make sure the engine runs and it was already floating and we bought a different engine so we kind of cheated but it worked anyway so um, we're gonna head home now this is probably only a short video so I don't know maybe I'll make it like into part of the other videos I'll put it at the start of one of the other ones or something um, Flynn loved it I think there'll be a few shots of us on the boat it was just freezing cold I think it's about 12 degrees and we had all oh, the trailer fell off when we were <laughs> reversing the boat in so that was really fun um, what else was there was that all that happened I think so yeah yeah but other than that we we're just getting wet and it's, it's a lot of reversing. really choppy a lot of reversing got stuck in the weeds just the usual tinny sort of stuff you know usual rookie errors so we're gonna head home and get warm Maybe get some Maccas or something. Could do. Oh, and we're going to drink our up and goes. Sponsor me up and go. 